to be doing a three heatless hairstyles for the summer so I'm going to be showing you some hairstyles three different hairstyles that are good for summertime my little bunny here charm is going to be joining us and yeah she was all like being annoying in her cage and stuff so I brought her out on the bed with me to film so, <laughs> so here she is little charmy so this is a collab with uh, blah, 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 blah. this is a collab with makeup by Emily 800 and we have the same name which is pretty darn cool so I decided that I would do a collab with her please go do me a favor check out her video and her channel in the down bar also um, I'm doing a meetup in Myrtle Beach South Carolina on June 6 from 12 to 1 p.m. at the Coastal Grand Mall make sure to check out all the info in the down bar don't bite me charm seriously stop <laughs> to also fan me on you now hashtag beauty by emily like literally my username is beauty by emily so look me up <laughs> let's just go ahead and jump into this tutorial so the first hairstyle is space buns and i've heard that this is one of the most trendy things to do in the summer are little buns that you can do like either right here or on top but they are adorable for summer and they keep the hair out of your face so that's what we're going to be doing for the first hairstyle so you're going to take your hairbrush and brush out your hair like you normally would <laughs> yeah, so you're just going to want to brush out your hair as normal as usual so you're going to want to start off with your hair down obviously like we just did you're going to need two elastics Okay, and you're sitting on the clips charm. And then you're gonna need two little claw clips and it's some bobby pins. So let's just go ahead and get started. So you're gonna section your hair off to two sides so it's like perfectly parted. I want to put it into a really, like wherever you want your space buns is where you need to put your ponytail. So I'm gonna do it right about here, up a little bit more and I'm gonna do it right there. Twist your hair around the ponytail holder like you would with a normal bun. Well, that's how I do mine's buns, but you don't have to, you know what I mean, okay? So you're just gonna twist it around like that and then secure it with your little clip. There you have it, one space bun. They're so cute. I'm gonna do the other side now, but yeah, so it's kind of really big. You can make yours a lot smaller, but I think they're so cute. Like, okay, so, awesome. um, this is how the other one turned out. It's really bad, I'm sorry, but yeah. So, um, as you can see, this part's kind of hanging out, so I'm gonna bobby pin it. But, um, yeah, so you're just bobby pinning everything down that is kind of falling out. That's kind of what you want to do. So this is what it looks like. I think this is one of the best hairstyles you can do for All the right, summertime. All right, so the next hairstyle I'm going to be doing is um, a braid into a ponytail. So I'm going to be doing a French braid that goes like along my head all the way back into a ponytail. The things you're going to need are obviously a hairbrush, a ponytail holder, and some bobby pins. So we're going to start off by um, French braiding our hair. So if you don't know how to French braid, basically what you do is you just like grab a piece of hair each time you're braiding. So you're going to start off by like taking your hair. You, I'm taking my like basically my little piece right here, my little layer, and you're going to want to braid that into your ponytail. So I don't really know how to explain it. It's super hard, but you're going to basically just want to like braid normally at first. Once you braid a couple times normally, you're going to want to um, grab a piece of hair. So like we're going to start off by taking this part right here that we're going to overlap next and we're going to add some hair from the front into the braid. See what I'm saying? Okay. 
And then you're going to take the same thing with this, take some extra hair, and pull it into the braid. So next you're going to want to take a piece from there, and you're going to want to braid it, um, like, go in the direction where you're going to make, make your ponytail. and tie this off. Now we're going to undo this elastic whenever we put our hair into a ponytail. But you're just going to want to do this until we have our ponytail made. So to pull your hair up into a ponytail, and I'll brush it out. And by the way, I brushed it out in the beginning. I just forgot to film it, so yeah. Back, because you don't want it completely on the side. So as you can see, we have the shape of our ponytail and you're just going to want to undo that braid that we held together. It's going to want to pull it back and brush out the ponytail a little bit. And then you're just going to tie off your little ponytail with an elastic and that's it. Like Once you have this made, you can pull out some pieces and stuff in the front. I think it's so cute mess it up a little bit and put your hair on the side so that's it basically this is adorable I love the way it finishes and it really gets it all out of your face the braid you can definitely fix it all up with some bobby pins which is what I'm gonna do right now and voila you have it it's adorable I love it I think it's so cute for the summertime and then for the last hairstyle it's super quick and easy and my hair was about to die so I gotta go through it really fast but <laughs> so basically all you have to do is just brush out your hair put it on two sides and then braid it on each side. You take you take it into three parts. Take your right over the middle, and then take the left over the middle, and then right over middle, left over middle. Take your elastic and tie it off. Then for the other side, you're going to do the same thing. There you go, you're just going to want to make it messy, not so tight. If you have problems with your hair falling out, you can definitely take some bobby pins and fix it up. But yeah, just pull it all out, untighten it, loosen it up, and that's it. It's so cute. I love it. So that's basically all you have to do. So that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Hope it was helpful. And make sure to check out Emily's video down below. Hope you enjoyed. See you next time. Give it a thumbs up. Like, comment, subscribe. Say bye. Say bye. Ah! Bye! Drop it low and pick it up Just like this